21-year-old Mason Richard Atta was lucky when a judge fined him 360 Ghana cities for stealing. His inability to pay the amount meant that he had to serve a one-year jail term. After serving eight months, an agenda by the Commonwealth Human Rights Initiative to help free petty offenders has helped secure his freedom. The human rights body believes minor offenders such as Richard should be made to serve non-custodial sentences and not thrown into jail. Maxwell Agwaba has more on the campaign by the Commonwealth Human Rights Initiative to keep minor offenders out of prison. Of course, starting without Richard and his friend Sammy gained their freedom. <laughs> It was a normal day for Richard until his friend asked him for a fun trip. He says after he complained about his financial difficulties, his friend later managed to convince him to snatch a woman's hand back on the street. An alarm was raised and he was nearly lynched. My mother and family members did not visit me at the police station. I am happy I'm free now. I did not get anyone to pay the 360 Ghana cities fine for me. Prison is not the best place to live. We did not get good food here. The soup was like a mirror. I saw my face in it any time I'm served. Humans are not supposed to eat that. I would advise young people to be careful out there. What happened before you come there? Richard's mate at the James Camp Prison Sami says he abandoned his work when he started facing financial difficulties and started breaking into the homes of his neighbors. He was arrested on the day he stole 1,300 Ghana CDs and a flat screen television. I'm a stubender. I forget the work we are do. I go ghetto. I follow friends go stay ghetto and live ghetto life. Follow friends, do bad things. You are breaking people's. If not catch her, you go straight. If you meet you, I will collect your things and them things. Then I know how to collect something from someone. The thing is not yours. To my own. If you sleep, I can come your your room inside. Can break take your things. If you're not there, I can break your door. Come still. The time you will come, you know. The push for non-custodial sentences recently increased after um, the incarceration of actress Rosemond um, Adade Brown. Well, the deputy director of prisons here at the James Camp Prison, Rafael Tuekbe, believes that non-custodial sentences will help decongest Ghana's prisons. Was somebody going to steal one file, and then he's been thrown into prison for three years? Calculate the amounts that the government is going to spend on that person. If you ask me, it would have been ideal if that person is sent to a poultry farm somewhere to support the poultry farm for even six months.